Greetings YouTube, Kundes here and welcome to episode 30 of this let's play in your Mario Bros. 4 for the Glorious Elephant. Where we last left off, Bamanis was attacking! We'll detach the siege, we'll totally go reinforce, we'll... wait, not yet. Not yet! He must lock his movement, he has locked his movement. We will reinforce and then retreat. And reinforce and then retreat on the war goal. He is such a good general though, it's so unfair. It's a much better general. We just have the numbers on our side. It's like the only thing we have on our side is that we can send a lot more bodies at this problem than he can. Absolutely fantastic. Victory. Undeniable, complete victory. And now, manpower depth of 10,000. Kill these things. For who I self implodes. Oh, hello, Ning Separatists. It would be nice to see you. It's so confusing the Qing permanent cores and the Tibet permanent cores. I mean, claims. I have to go kill Qing. Eventually. First, though, we'll deal with these. Is he sending another army at us? No, he's not. Alright, Arissa, you deal with whatever invades your territory. It's not my problem. Tibet, why are you so useless? You're supposed to be useful. We've killed the Huai rebels. Let's go kill the other ones. Ooh, but Manus's war enthusiasm is sinking very rapidly. Ah, crap. Stop it! Oh, he's changed his mind. And he's changed his mind again. It's gonna be another big battle. Which he seemingly refuses to commit to. Bomani pretender rebels have attacked me? What? That's such garbage! Go away, you bastards! I'm killing your rebels. Get your shit together. Ah, oh, crap. All because of the stupid Bamani pretender rebels. Oh, oh, this is disastrous. My front line. My front line! Damn it! It's such bullshit! I would have won that battle if not for the stupid Bomani Pretender Rebels. Il Bourbon is self-sustaining. Fantastic. Let's get Mauritius while we're here. We'll have to deal with two Separatists. I don't want to deal with two Separatists. Yeah, screw the siege for now. I do want to see Ning come out of there. Then Huai could just go eat. Where the hell are we retreating to? Ah, oh, this hurts so much. Oh, we've lost the war goal. This is so stupid. You were saved by your pretender rebels, Bamanis. Oh, but we will be back. We will be back. Recruited Inquisitor has expired. I want to recruit another Inquisitor. I can't really afford him though. Hmm. Oh, we're almost Captain Military Points. Let's stack up. Get better horses while we're moving. Banner Cavalry, activate! Did Arissa get stack wiped? I think he did. Should probably not stick around that close with low morale, but uh, I don't know where he went. 
Oh, we have a fort back there. Good job, vassal. Bagelkand. He's still in this war. That's hilarious. Bomanis is still at war with Bagelkand and Dundar. Let's go back to city on Costa. Whoa, 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 whoa. No worries. Whoa. Let's run. Good job, Delhi. This is so dreadful. I need a better general. You're not a good general. I'll buy a new general. You're still garbage. You are also still garbage. Third one? What? What? There we go. Took a lot of rolls, but finally got one that was not garbage. You're fired, you're fired, you're fired, you're fired. You're given a job. And uh, you're fired. There we go, 3-3. Three, three. Now we are matched, Bamatis. Such a waste of military points, holy crap. But I needed that, I needed a better general. That was the only thing missing against this guy. Forced myself, but it's not sufficient. I don't have enough cannons. That said, his cannons are starting to show up in the front row. So are mine. This is not a good battle. This is still not a good battle. Uh, he's starting to win. Means the coalition could trigger at any point. Oh, I'm still making gains apparently. But I don't know how, because he's winning every single battle now. Such garbage. Is Volanadu just like. Yeah, it's a terrible defensive. Uh, oh, attempt to swash their pain. Always. Always! Hawaii is the key. You can almost tech up in uh, Diplo. Am I coring everything? Malakan separatists, what the hell? Terenganu, Bintan, and Sarangor. Yeah, it's the three Sunni provinces. Uh, let's just give them some autonomy. Just so I don't have to deal with those rebels and ruling is still going to be a pain. Technically, fortunately, I have an army nearby, but... Um, I don't know how that's gonna go. Okay, let's leave the armies... In our territory? Where's the third army? Holy crap, it's not far enough. Run away faster. Also, are you like entirely? Yeah, you're pretty much entirely. I should substitute out your front line with mercs. That is what I need to do. Let's go do that here. I will manage you to be a better front line. Because clearly your current composition is unacceptable. Ah, 28,000 manpower debt. That is rough. Malak and separatists are going away for now. We'll have to finish converting that. Okay, how many frontliners do we need? I have six mercs, which means I have eight non mercs. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, I have eight non mercs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, now 
You guys, stop costing me manpower. Okay, that fixed the manpower debt by 8,000, approximately. And it will make this army replenish faster. Huai has reclaimed its sting. Great. Let's go park this army on Wu Ling. Until they spawn. Ah, crap. Bamanis is... Whoa, he's engaging me here. Let's go reinforce ourselves. Will I make it? I won't make it. Let's retreat. Did not manage to retreat very far, but... Uh, native assimilation in Hawaii, which is nice. Ah, crap. I'm losing this war so much right now. I have a tech on him, but it doesn't matter. Like, it... it... <sighs> It's not a good tech that I have on min on him, admittedly. Oh, he's splitting his armies! No, he's not. How's his manpower? Wrangle still has none. Bamanis has no manpower. 40,000 troops. How many mercs, though? 27 mercs. How are we doing? We can force limit. That's a good way to put it. I have no manpower, 44 mercs. I have more mercs than he does. I have more troops than he does, technically. And I have double his force limit. Like, all things considered, I should not be losing. Oh, this is jungle. I don't want to attack him in a jungle. He attacked me in a jungle crossing a river and he won. You bastard. Uh. Bengal Delta is such a good province. Do I attack? Do I attack? How's the front lines? You still have like, uh, you still have non-merc front line. Damn it. You have absolutely no front line. Okay, let's let's go. Uh, let's go fix up the stacks. Then we'll be back. Okay. We'll be back, Bamanis. How many mercs? How many more mercs can I build? Uh, isn't it supposed to tell me? I thought there was a limit on mercs. Oh, 22 available. There we go. I'm just blind. So let's figure this out. How can we fix up these armies? You're out of the way. You need... Out of 19, 10. So you need 10 mercs. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. Okay. And take these 10 guys. We're gonna combine them for now. We're probably gonna ditch them. Oh, it's starting to cost us a lot of money, probably from reinforcements. Although I'm guessing mercs are still expensive. We do have admin idea, right? Pretty sure I picked it. Yes, I do. Okay, good. Cheaper mercs. And doesn't uh, Utah also have? Yeah, mercenary cost minus 20%. So I have a lot cheaper mercs. But they're still not cheap enough. Where is the useless army? Here, you're fired. Yeah. Okay, maybe I can keep you as is. Oh, I can go back up to three stability. I like three stability. Keeps the rebels away. Oh, government form and ranks is uh, reducing my autonomy. Nice. Because I am a despotic monarchy empire. Change to feudal monarchy, which is garbage. Uh, 
If I tech up, I could go for administrative monarchy. What I'm really after is absolute monarchy. Yeah. Just tech 20. Ooh, I can get the settlers. Nice, and I can get early modern. Why not? We still have enough admin points. Go down there. Okay, we'll have to go liberate mid the poor. Let's take the good general, send him here, send you in support. I'll go attack Bamanis. He's a. Shun has left the coalition. Ah, crap, more rebels. What is this? Chu separatists? They're gonna spawn in my country too! What a coincidence. Okay, this army is now ready to go back to the front lines. Where we will strike at the... Oh, he did not get it! He did not get it! Okay, how much are we losing? Army maintenance is 60 ducats. Of that, there is 7.79 that is reinforcements. So if we weren't reinforcing, that'd be nice. Advisor costs are also kicking our butt because this guy is expensive. But we wanted the military points to do the teching up thing. Comes with the territory. Maybe we'll have to take a loan at some point. I hope not. Maybe we'll cut back on some things when we get closer to it. Okay. You will walk here. You will attack. You will reinforce. And then you will reinforce. Okay. Let's go. Let's save our fort. I'm attacking in the jungle, which is really bad. But his armies are divided. He's back to high enthusiasm. He's like, I matter! The only thing you do, and Delhi clearly has been doing some work while he was up here sieging me. Let's go back down where it's comfy and we threaten his positions. I like that. How's the manpower to- oh, we can explore first. The ruling separatists finally showed up. Uh, let's explore the South West Pacific. We're seeing the coast of our second objective, the land of Eastern Jade. Okay, let's go kill that. I'm gonna borrow the general. Just so I can kill that more easily. Wow, rebels, do you even general? Clearly they don't. And we'll be able to bring this army over. We've squished the Bomanis army. We've squished the stupid rebels. Let's squish that with the general. We've squished a bunch of. <laughs> we've squished a cannon. <laughs> nice. Okay, let's get this to the front lines. Over in Midnapur. He is now not able to stop me. Oh, yes! 25 Diplo points for progress? Sign me up! Sign me up. Okay, we have regained the war goal, it is now ours, and it now ticks in our favor. How about them apples? Hmm. How's Hawaii? Oh, great. So great, how's the boats? The monastic order gains influence. Grout of the putting out system has expired, their influence is now uh, down. Whatever. Um, I still have disloyal estates, the nobility is about to be loyal again. Um, what can I do? I can't do anything for these guys to gain more... Uh... Crap, can I still convert? Yes, okay. Conversion's still ongoing. Okay. How about you give me admin points? Yeah! 
I like getting free admin points. But why is this siege still at 28% progress? That is crap. I have an army coming to stop them, but if he sits another army, he's going to resume that progress. Why is it still 28%? I thought I thought I kicked them off that province. How can it still be 28%? makes no sense. Game, you make no sense. Let's put the good general here. This army has a slight front line of uh, crappy non-mercs that cost us manpower to maintain. Our manpower debt is down to 10,000, which is great. Uh, lose karma or gain karma and gain prestige. I personally like me the karma and the prestige. This would unlock an achievement right there. <laughs> but I already have it because it's kind of easy to get. But it looks so nice. It's like most stable, most prestigious, but Manus is attacking me so f screw this guy. Damn he hurts. We finished integration of Pasai. Oh nice. Look at that font. Ah, oh, crap, I can't convert to Sunni stuff anymore. Oh yeah, because I lost the 2% from the Monastic Order bonuses. Darn it! What's the rebels at? Are you tying noble rebels? Ah, oh, crap, that's the uh, unrest. I need to peace out. I really need to peace out. The Hindu zealots were building, so we're going to start converting something else. Uh, like Fujo. Hurry, reinforce! Yes, we have made it. He is losing this battle. We've killed the Bindapur stack. Come down here, you. Your manpower debt is going up, but not by that, that much. Okay, the army led by the general is going to stay on the province. The army that is very weak is going to stay on Vilanlu. Ah, oh, I have to go kill that. Okay, let's... Uh, more karma, more prestige. Why not? Estates demand control of territory. Nobility. Where can I give you a crap province? That's not a crap province. That's kind of... Well, it's not a good province. So it will do. generating unrest because I hate my nobility and they hate me back. They're very soon to... Wow, they're still unhappy. What more do you want? Here, take that province. Still not? What the hell? Hmm. Those were good provinces. Silhet is not that good. Uh, that's a garbage province. There we go. Nobility happy. Leave me alone. Oh, they're back to 40 lo loyalty. There we go. That's going to help with some rebellions. Probably like these provinces. While we're waiting, you're gonna get the good general. Oh, I can't borrow him. You're gonna not get a general, and you were gonna charge into the Bengali separatists and crush them. Oh, I have precise army up here. It's costing me more money. Okay, can I have a positive war score? That'd be great. I do occupy forts. Where is the war score multi negative? From 25 battles, I've been, well, me and probably mostly Delhi have been losing battles. Let's go kill these things. No general, no problem. They don't have any general either. Dice to dice, troops to troops, bodies to bodies. Yeah. It's almost poetic. Ah, oh, crap.
Well, at least we're being the rebels. Let's bring that down back there. We just want Costa. Like, really badly. Yeah, that was bound to lose. He's still winning war score from battles. Bastard. Still, I have 10% war score, I can't make demands. I cannot stack wipe this guy. It's so annoying. Oh, Delhi almost has the capital. Oh, that's gonna be good. Orissa is starting to listen very, very well. Mostly because the vassals are becoming weaker than me. By a noticeable margin. Tibet could be got. Oh my. Tibet could be fed indefinitely now. He is loyal enough that he could. Oh. This is fantastic. Fantastic news. It's so good, there's no more Sunni in here. It fills me with joy. Ah, oh, crap. Delhi, don't lose! Quick! Go throw more bodies! I won't be able to reinforce in time! I want this. Ah! Oh. No! Must make it! Hold Delhi! Hold the line! Ah, oh, crap, he didn't make it! Well, we're throwing bodies at him. He's not doing a very good job at it, but, uh doing a good enough job at it. We've gotten the Siege of Costa, so finally the Wargold will stop turning away from us. We finally have positive war score, so that's good. Uh, actually, I could make Delhi listen to me by... Oh, I could... Let's put my relative on throne, and let's just placate him. Who needs prestige, really, right? There we go. Now Orissa listens. I'll gain my prestige back. In no time at all. Nice. And now we've pulled the vassal into the war. We'll obtain his capital shortly. This army is useless to me, it's the Pasai army. I'm gonna delete it. I'm gonna bring that to the front lines. I probably could have salvaged the horses and the cannons, but I don't need more. Well, I could have actually. I could have. No, I could have used the cannons, but not the horses. I guess though I could have kept the can. Ah, oh, crap, I'm still losing a lot of money. Mauritius produces fish. How much money are we talking about here? Mostly from reinforcements. That is all we are losing. But once we have 10% force. Oh! Particularists. Wow. Ah, oh, crap. He's attacking me on his capital. He knows. He knows what I'm trying to do. There we go. We're reinforced with the general. At the very least, let's get this army in there as well. This is such an uh, intense war. There we go. Let's kill these guys. There we go. Oh, stack wipe too. Nice. I'm gonna keep the cannons there because they're giving me siege progress. Oh, Amanis is now fighting rebels left, right, and center. So's Delhi. Apparently, we're all fighting uh, Amanis' rebels. I'm okay if he self destructs. I don't want to lose admin points, but I don't really want uh, that, so I'm gonna lose some admin points. War exhaustion is very high. No rebels, though. Like, very barely anything. We're still making Fujo progress. Hawaii has become self-sustaining. Nice! But 
we can't get the land of Eastern Jade yet, because we can't, haven't explored that. But we've also reached the end of the episode, so for now, I will thank you guys for watching, and I will see you next time where we colonize something else.